Okay, right, rant time. Right, when I hear that the army spent £1.6 million pounds on an advertising campaign, and then I see the end result, and it's the load of politically collect mumbo jumbo heap of shit, it makes my blood boil. And why does it make Big Phil's blood boil? I'll tell you why it makes Big Phil's blood boil, because basically what you're doing again is just wasting money. Now there's three R's in the regiment in, 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 in the army as far as I'm concerned at the moment that are going completely wrong. Recruitment, retention, and resettlement. The three R's. Don't lose sight of those three R's, because that is where the army are massively failing in every fucking given opportunity, okay? So, we've looked at this new advert, which is aimed at recruitment, okay? And it's given us a mishmash of politically correct, absolute fucking madness, all right? I want to see an advert that wants to make me join the army. I want to see an advert that shows me thrusting my way around the world, standing up for the people I believe in, being at the forefront of everything alley that goes on in my life. That's what I want to see. That's what blokes want to see. That's what you want to be part of. I don't give a flying fuck what gender, what race, what colour, what religion, where you come from, how much money you've got, and all the rest of the fucking considerations that they're trying to appease to. I don't give a shit about any of them. Because you either want to be a soldier or you fucking don't. So that pales into insignificance. I don't care. If you're a female and you want to join the infantry, if you pass your test, you're in. I don't care if you're gay and you want to be in the artillery. You're in. So long as you want to be a fucking soldier, so long as you want to stand up, take the Queen's shilling and fight alongside other people that have the same interests and stand for the common good of this fucking country, you're in. Okay? It's no fucking back drill. It's no fucking difficulty. There's nothing hard about it. All right? You either want to stand up and fight for this country or you don't. I don't care who you fucking are, okay? So with that said, let's cut all the mishy-washy fucking mandy pandy bullshit out of this fucking crap, okay? And let's show people stuff that will make them want to fucking join and not make them want to fucking hang themselves. And while we're about it, how about we send some reassuring messages out if you want to fucking reassure anybody that you're not going to get done for doing your fucking job, that you will be looked after when you get out, that your pension won't be fucked around with, and you're going to be fucking looked after when you're in, and you're going to get some fucking alley trips and decent fucking range time. How about that? And spend a bit of fucking money on the British fucking army rather than fucking sending it all around the fucking world to various fucking aid packages that we don't give a fuck about. How about that? How about fucking that? All right? So, British Army, you did like my fucking rant earlier. You did like my fucking rail read of the advert for the BBC. You've seen my stuff. You've seen the fucking advert that I did for the BBC today. All right? Now you're seeing this is my advert, okay? This is my advert for the British Army. Let's get young, young people into the armed forces to turn them into fucking awesome pieces of fucking gear that fucking stand up for our country. All right? No fucking, no fucking drama there, is it? How difficult is that one? All right? Because people want inspiration. People don't want fucking wishy-washy, mamby-bamby, bullshitting, politically correct fucking bollocks. my table! Shut up. People want to be inspired when they join the army. They don't want to be mincing around. They're not joining the fucking white people's asses. They're joining to wipe them off the planet. All right? They're joining to engage with the enemy. They're joining to do all the fine things I did when I was in, all right? They're not joining to fucking mollycoddle each other and fucking... Make stupid noises on the side of fucking mountains as they trudge up fucking singing. That's not fucking tactical. That's bollocks. I want to see soldiers. And I don't care. Like I said, I don't care what colour, creed, religion, gender, race, religion, fuck anything. I don't care about that. I want soldiers in the army. And I don't care where they come from. So British Army, you are getting this whole thing massively, massively fucking wrong. Okay? Massively wrong. Right. Let's see what people have got to say about that then, shall we? Okay. I was going to show the adverts on it, but I don't even want to show the fucking advert. I don't even want to promote the fucking thing. All right? It's just a load of fucking hideousness that some idiot has been paid £1.6 million to produce. You, sir, are a waste of money. Should I give it a big fill? I'd have put the recruitment through the fucking roof for you. You £1.6 million for an advert. I know, yeah. What a load of... Now, Private Bacon next stood on the fucking gate without any fucking Gore-Tex. What's that about? Yeah, tossers.